Happy Monday morning, Glads. I'm Abby Lorbecki. And I'm Anthony Berkey, and this is your KWHS News. Attention juniors and seniors, college visits this month are coming to a close. CSU Fort Collins wraps up the month with their visit on November 17th. Make your plans early to check in with these college reps by getting a pass from the Counseling Center. Seniors, filling out your FAFSA forms just got easier. Widefield High School is hosting the Parent Financial Aid and FAFSA Night tomorrow at 6 p.m. It will be here in the library. PPCC is bringing in experts to help us navigate the FAFSA process. Bring tax information to maximize this opportunity. If you have any questions, contact Mr. Hall in the Counseling Center at this number or by email. Time to find out what we're having for lunch. Miss Betsy? Good morning, welcome back. It's Monday. I hope you all enjoyed your three-day weekend. Today we're gonna have a cheeseburger, so stop by and see us. And tomorrow, we're having chicken fajitas. Yum, yum. Bye. Mmm, I'm hungry already. The Gladi Actors present The Giver, a story about a boy stuck in a strange world where the government controls everything. Shows are scheduled for November 17th to the 19th at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. The cost is $7 for adults and $5 for students. Come see how Jonas finds his path. Now here's the sports team with your sports update. Good morning, Glads. I'm Elijah Clark. I'm Dylan Ham. And this is your Gladiator Sports Update. If you missed the football meeting last week, please see Coach Only for more information or turn your equipment. You guys wanted to play volleyball. Here's your chance. The annual gents tourney is around the corner. You need six players per team. Sign-ups are until November 16th in Miss Ship's room. The cost is $5. If you are interested in being an athletic trainer for winter sports but missed last week's meeting, please see Miss St. James in room 511. If you missed the wrestling practice on Saturday, see Coach Walker in room 205. Congratulations to the cheer squad for their performance at the Colorado Springs Metro League competition last week. I'm Elijah Clark. I'm Dylan Ham. Have a great Monday. Now back to Abby and Anthony. Thank you, gentlemen. Hi, guys. Um, so, Power Club Link Crew and Peer Mediators are promoting the Kindness Game. Um, we're going to be doing this on Tuesday and Wednesday. And, and what it is, is it's just like a little bingo sheet. Um, and it's just got some random acts of kindness. We just really are trying to promote people being nice, being kind to each other. So there's stuff on here like smile at 10 people, hold the door open for someone. Tuesday after school, Wednesday at lunch, and Wednesday after school, there's going to be a table in front of the main office where you can turn in your bingo sheet, um, get a sticker, and sign our Kindness Game poster. DECA is currently collecting pop tabs to help support the Ronald McDonald House. Your donations help ill children have a safe place to stay during medical procedures and help DECA secure a spot in Nationals. Last year, we donated 17 pounds of tabs. We are aiming to donate 50 pounds of pop tabs this April. To beat the record, we need 300 pounds. Will you help us get there? Drop off your donations in Ms. Hildebrand's mailbox or in room 159. Glads, are you into club? Welding club in the metal shop until 4 p.m. with Mr. Jones and science club will be in Miss Carmody's room 121 at lunch. Senior council is starting a book drive from November 14th to the 18th. Bring in kids books or money to the table near the main office. Whichever grade level that brings the most books and money will get an extended lunch on November 20th. I'm Anthony Berkey and I'm Abby Lorbecki and this was your KWHS News. <laughs>